see the road out there. That's awesome. <laughs> this is a tiny ribbon. Tiny little thread of pavement. Lone Pine Death Valley. Very warm. Hospitable sort of name. Furnace Creek. Lovely. Oh dear, let's go to Furnace Creek. Sounds like a lovely place. I bet they got hot showers. Oh honey, I want to go to Lone Pine. Wait. I just did a country accent. Married to a British lady. Whatever. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Crazy. They're farming something in the lake. Look what that is. See right there. like 40, nah, it's probably like 50 degrees, 50, 60 degrees, and uh, you can still see the, the shimmering, the heat shimmering off the road, and off the lake, man, I bet in the summer, you can barely even see it, because it's just so, so much heat waves coming off of it. attempt to explain the mirage effect but I don't remember the, the gory details of the light bending stuff but okay so a road is made up of little little tiny pieces of rock held together with tar right I mean more or less but it's if you look at it on a microscopic scale it's bumpy and bumpy so it's got lots of points uh, so, when you're looking at the road, at a very shallow angle, you're looking at a bunch of little points, right? Okay, well the way light works, when it crosses something, uh, when it, when it passes an edge, within, uh, so many nanometers of that edge, the light bends. So, what ends up happening is because you're looking at one, one point or ridge followed by another point or ridge that is, from your perspective, only nanometers above the one behind it, or, or below the one behind it, you end up with a, uh, a reflection phenomenon where the light uh, bends, it's coming down from whatever's above, and it passes the little edge and it bends. But because you're looking at nothing but little edges, essentially, there's nothing large enough to not have light bend around it, you end up with all the light from above bending back up, and you it's a reflection. So it, it, it's essentially a mirror, uh, what it, it effectively becomes. That's how mirages work. And so, you know, it's all—it's always in the very far away, or wherever we're looking at the road at a very, very shallow angle. And as we approach it, we get up to the point where, okay, now we're looking at the actual rocks and not just all the edges. And so, the light, there is still some light bending, but most of it is, we're looking at the light that's actually bouncing off of the rock and reflecting the rock's color. When I say rock, I mean, you know, a little piece of, uh, whatever they make the road of. There's a word for that, I can't remember. Aggregate. Yes. Aggregate. I 
feel like there's a road winding up the mountain. Bye, Owen's leg. Bye. These hills right here in front of the, like right down in the valley, I believe those are what is known, what are known as the Alabama Hills. I think. If it's not those, there's some further up that are like that. I'm pretty sure that's them. The Alabama Hills. With the Sierra Nevadas. Those are the highest, right there. There's some 14ers in there. <laughs> 